One of the great things about being on internship this year is that I get to spend time with the students at the elementary school connected to the parish. They're fun, they're full of hope, and Lord knows they have inquisitive minds. Which is why this week on Ask Brother Casey, they've submitted their own questions. I have not looked at any of these, but I'm sure we'll find some good ones. All right. First question. Have you ever went to a football game? It depends what you mean. Yes, I have never been to an NFL game, but I've been to many college games, and I played football in middle school, so I've got to play in games. Thank you. From Hannah in 4A, what's your favorite emoji? I'm sad to say I don't know if I have a favorite emoji. Sorry. From Will in 5A, how long does it take to become a priest? Uh, well, it takes about seven years, depending on uh, which order you're with. Diocesan might take a little less, but for us, it takes about eight years. Okay, from Katerina in first grade, why do you wear a brown robe? That is a great question. So we wear a brown robe because St. Francis of Assisi wore a brown robe. Uh, he wanted to look like the poor, and this is what the poor look like. And so for 800 years, we've worn very simple clothing, not flashy colors, no diamonds or pearls. We just want to be simple in what we wear. From Grace in fifth grade, what are your hobbies? Well, I always like to play sports, so I like baseball and football. Uh, sometimes I get to go play golf. But I also like to go on hikes and to take pictures and uh, just to hang out with friends. From Davy. How did you find the church you wanted to work at? Well, you see, in the Franciscans, we don't necessarily get to pick where we go. We go where the need is. So I told what I wanted to do, and the, uh, my order chose a few options for me, and we had a discussion, and we found the best one. But it's not always up to me. All right, from Zelly in KA, do you like getting greeting cards? Yes, I like getting greeting cards, especially when they have money in them. Those are always nice to get from my aunts and uncles. From Stephanie, are you a perfectionist or you have any big pet peeves? Um, I can't say I'm a perfectionist, but I like to work really hard and get things done the way they should be. Pet peeves? Um, I don't know, when, maybe when people chew with their mouth open, that's, that's kind of annoying. What is your favorite frog? Send me a picture. Um, I, I guess I'd have to go with Kermit. Kermit is my favorite frog. From Logan in 4B, how are you supposed to trust other people that you don't trust? That's a really tough question, but I think it's a really good one. And for me, there are a lot of people that I don't trust right away. There are a lot of strangers out there you just don't know. And so I guess the best thing to do would be to start getting to know them. Ask them questions, learn about who they are you might find that you, you start to trust them without even realizing it. All right, from a first grade student, how many days till 2017? How many days till Christmas? Excellent questions. Um, let's see, there are exactly 68 days left in 2016 till we get to 2017, and exactly 61 days until Christmas. Good question. Why did you decide to be a friar? Good question. I decided to be a friar because I wanted to work for the church and really to work for the poor. The poor don't always have people to look after them and we as friars uh, want to be like the poor and serve them wherever we can. So that's why I wanted to be a friar. All right, from a fifth grade student. What is your favorite movie? Well, I can say my favorite Pixar movie is probably Wally -E or Finding Nemo. Those were both pretty good. Um, I also like the Batman movies uh, and Star Wars. Those are all really awesome. What's your favorite food? Hmm, I have a lot of favorite foods. I would say Italian, something like that. Maybe eggplant parmesan. I like vegetables a lot too, so, so broccoli. That would be one of my best meals. Is being a friar difficult from Alan in 5A? Uh, well, yeah, it is difficult, but a lot of things in life are difficult. Being married is difficult. Having kids is difficult. Uh, working as a teacher is difficult. But I would say just because something's difficult doesn't mean it's not great. And so I love being a friar, even though some things about it can be kind of challenging. 
What was your favorite thing to do as a kid? Alexis wants to know. Uh, I loved to play baseball uh, and to play video games. Those were two really fun things to do. All right, from Bailey in 4B. Um, how do you get through a hard time in your life? Hmm, that is difficult. Um, we all face hard times. We have tests, we have fights with friends and family. I would say the best way to get through it is a prayer, uh, going to God and telling God what's going on and asking for help. And then the other thing is to find good people in your life, friends, family, other people that are outside the situation that can support and help you. Uh, we all go through hard times, but we always have those things with us to help us. From Syra in fifth grade, if you weren't a friar and if you weren't Catholic, what would you do in your life? Um, you know, I haven't thought about that question in a very long time um, because I'm pretty comfortable with both of those things. Um, but I don't know, maybe, maybe I'd make movies. Um, maybe I'd try to be a baseball player. I'm a little old now. Um, I don't know, I'm just so comfortable being Catholic and being a friar, I can't even think of a good answer. All right, it's from, from Maddie in KA. Do you like books and what kind? Yes, I love books. One of my favorite books of all time is Harry Potter. I love those books a lot. Um, but I also like other books. Uh, biographies about the saints are great. Um, I love adventure books uh, and mysteries. Mysteries are really great. All right, from Marcy in fourth grade. How does it feel like to be asked like a million questions? <laughs> Well, like, uh, it's what I like to do. So I don't mind being asked a million questions. As long as people are learning, I'm happy to answer them. Thanks. All right, from Zamaya. Do you love Immaculata School? Yes, yes I do. And the students are absolutely great. Thanks for the question. Do babies go to heaven if they die? Um, that's a very good question. It's a very sad question. I would say uh, that we honestly don't know, but the best answer I can give is that God is a loving and merciful God, and he wants all things and all people to come to himself. And so the baby didn't do anything wrong, and so we hope that all babies go to God. All right. From Kate in fourth grade, who do you look up to? Uh, well, when I grew up, one of my favorite baseball players was Derek Jeter. Definitely a role model to me because he played the game right and he played it really hard and he never got in trouble. So he was a big role model. But both my parents are great role models and there are a number of friars today that I, I look up to and I always go to when I have a question. All right, from John in 5B, what is your favorite sport? My favorite sport is baseball, but I love to watch football as well. Why does God let bad things happen like hurricanes? Whew, that is a difficult question to answer quickly. Um, but I would start off by saying I think God loves everyone no matter what. And so God doesn't send punishments or he doesn't want people to suffer. That's where we got to start. I think sometimes they're just natural occurrences. Hurricanes happen all the time. Uh, and in some ways they can be really good. They can water the plants. They can help other life. Um, so. You know, I don't know, um, but I have answered this question a little more in depth that you can click right here to see it. And finally, last question from Nathan. Do you like games? Yes, I love games. I love to play sports. I love to play board games uh, and card games. My family plays card games all the time. Thanks for the question. Big thanks to all the students at Immaculata for these questions. They were great. If you at home have a question you'd like me to answer, you can leave it in the comments, send me a personal message, or check me out on Facebook, Casey Cole OFM. Music